Ice Creams, Pancakes and Waffles restaurant at sea. So there are several locations at the marina. You see all the different locations? And we are at one of those locations. We are here in Jalisco, the state of Jalisco. We're eating everywhere in the state of Jalisco. And most definitely in Puerto Vallarta. Please stay tuned because we're gonna bring you some amazing spots so you know where to go and where not to go. Let's go. So Food Fun Finance, I'm here with <laughs> And she is accompanying me and tasting all this beautiful food. What you got there? A vanilla ice cream shake. A vanilla ice cream shake? How is it? It's good. It's really good. Do you like it? Mm -hmm. I like mine too. But I'm going to dive right into this coffee though. It's pretty strong. I need a little bit more sugar. Stay tuned, Food Fun Finance. The food is on the way. So, Food Fun Finance, all the food is coming out all at once. And I'm gonna go ahead and try to taste as much as I can. So, I could tell you off the rip, right, that this Belgian waffle is soft. Look at that. Look at that. to the next place. Hey, you getting too happy, girl. So Food Fun Finance, we are back. What's this, French toast? What you eating? You eating pancakes? We diving into this right here. Caramel French toast with strawberries, bananas, whipped cream, chocolate, Nutella. Some real soft French toast. Stay tuned. That's a real good pancake. I'll make this It's out of five. A nine out of ten. So that means that's a four out of five. It's good, isn't it? So breakfast burrito Mexican style. It's refried beans and it looked like jalapenos and it's guac. You want these jalapenos? Ah. Holy crap, it has spicy. <coughs> oh shit! Well, unfortunately, as you see from the last clip, the burrito took me out of the game. So I had to swap plates with my son, who loves spicy food. I can't do it. Like the whole right side of my mouth like went numb. So they had like real fine slices of jalapenos in there. So when I was looking at the menu and I asked him what was a Mexican style egg, he explained it to me, but he said green peppers. So in the US, green peppers is green peppers. I think here, green peppers is jalapeno. So I was thinking it was bell peppers and he knew it was jalapeno. But I found out later on that it was jalapeno and I suffered the car. It's hot. Woo! Holy crap. I like the French toast. So the burrito wasn't bad. It had a lot of good flavors to it, and it really tasted good, but I would give it a 4.5. It's just, I'm just not a spicy fanatic, so it threw me off. But it was really good. But these French toasts, oh my goodness. The French toast, the pancakes, yeah. Now I see why they call it Mr. Cream Pancakes and Waffles. Cause they have mastered the pancake and waffles. You got to come check this place out. Stay tuned for the review. So Full Fun Finance, Mr. Cream's Pancake and Waffles, Etsy was a hit. So we're gonna go over your most favorite part of the show, which is the reviews. We're gonna go over environment, customer service, food, and pricing, okay? So let's go over the environment. Did you like the environment, Magic? It's like outdoors. It's outdoorsy. Kind of look like we in the jungle, kind of, don't it? Yeah. It's real tropical. And it has a lot of 
palm trees. A lot of, a lot of palm trees. It looks very tropical. So from a one to a five, what would you rate the environment? A four. A four? I would say a five, because we're in Mexico. Oh, yeah, you, we are. You gotta get excited when you're in Mexico. So it gotta be a five. It gotta be a five. Gotta be a five. So with that being said, the environment, five. Five. In Mexico, that's where we at. So now we're gonna go into the customer service. How you feel about the customer service? You know what customer service is? When the people bring you the food and the drinks. Mm -hmm. and Were you happy when they did that? I give it like a three or four. A three or four? You was real happy with it? They gave you all the stuff that you asked for? Yeah. It made you so happy. So I would say a five for the customer service. They did an excellent job. Amazing. Yay! So, customer service of five, we're gonna move right along to the food. So, Majesty, tell me what you think about the food. The food was definitely a five. It was definitely a five. The food is so good. Oh my goodness. What, what you had? Pancakes, right? Yeah, and the ice cream. Uh-huh. What about the milkshake? The milkshake was amazing. It was the bomb. The milkshake was amazing. Mm-hmm. You didn't even get to taste anything else, did you? No. Because that was just enough for you. But I tasted a lot of different things and I really liked the uh, Belgian waffle and I really liked the French toast. So I think we need to do a French toast compilation and I promise you like that would be in the top five, top ten if we do if we do a, a French toast compilation, because those were good. With that being said, the overall food, I'd give a 4.5. Well, Brittany says 4.5. I'm leaning more towards 4.8, but um, yes, it is a go for sure. Now, we're gonna segue into the pricing. It was 17.94 pesos. What does that accumulate to in American dollars drum roll please a hundred and five dollars for five people to eat excellent food i think that is astonishing it was an excellent price i would give the price a 4.0 most definitely because we had a lot what you think you like the price you ain't paid for none <laughs> So, with that being said, Food Flow Finance, this place is most definitely a go. It is a hit. Come try it out. If you're in Mexico, if you're in Puerto Vallarta, there are four different locations, so there is no reason why you shouldn't be able to go try out at least one of these locations. It's funny because on our first trip here, we were supposed to go try them out, and when we got there, we couldn't find it. It was uh, at the Marina in uh, Vallarta and we couldn't find it, so we ended up going to Los Alcatraz. And it's crazy that we ended up going on this trip, and it was just as good as Los Alcatraz. It was amazing. So Food Phone Finance, until next time, we got plenty of videos coming out. Plenty of videos. So what you need them to do, uh, Majesty? Is comment, like, and Make sure you watch us every Wednesday and Saturday at 7 p.m. We are here to expose you to these amazing places. So Food Fund Finance, do me a huge favor to keep this channel going, to keep this channel growing. Make sure you like, subscribe, comment down below, and let me know anything that's on your mind so we can keep this community growing. Let's go. Okay.